<laughs> All right, guys, welcome back. How are you doing? In this episode, we are going to be discussing how to get ERC20 token price. And this works with any ERC20 on any chain. This is the best, most price efficient way to get ERC20 token price and also to get the 24 hour change, how much the price has increased or decreased in the last 24 hours. The reason I'm saying this is price efficient, this is cost efficient, is because if you use CoinGecko or some other API, you're going to get ruined, ruinated with, with, uh, with the prices that they have. And also they don't have as many different uh, uh, coins and tokens as uh, Morales has, as we have, which I will soon show you. Because we have all on-chain prices. All tokens, if it's trading on the DEX, we have the price. That's why right now, what, what do you do? You go to docs.morales.io. You'll come to this page. You're going to see something like this. Next, you can go here to token API, price, ERC20 token price. You see how you can install the SDK and do it very easily with the SDK. But if you want to try this on the website, you go to API reference and then you here go to token API and then to get token price. Then you're going to see this page. Next, you enter an address here. So here you can enter any address you want, any ERC20. <laughs> so here right now I'm entering the Matic ERC20 token on Ethereum. And then you click try it right here. And what do you get back? You do get back the price right like here, the native price, which will be in the, denominated in ETH because right now we're checking the Matic token price on ETH. So you get the native token price, but then also the USD price and then the 24 hour change price <clears throat> as well. You can go to CoinGecko, you can compare. Let me refresh. As you can see on CoinGecko, it's 0, uh, 0 0.89 and uh, it is the same. And uh, the 24 hour change is 1.6%. Here's 1.9, but they don't have real time. They have uh, cash and so on and so forth. So this is a real, real time that you get right here. Uh, you can try any other coin. You can go here, you can go and you can uh, check. Uh, let, let's say, for example, Shiba Inu. You go here to Shiba Inu, you copy the address like so. Then you go here, very easy. You paste it in here, bam, you click run. <clears throat> and what do you get back? This you get back. You get back USD price, this 0.008, this is the same. Uh, and uh, the 24 hour change is minus 2.48. Uh, 2 and this is exact, like this is in real time. This is exactly from 24 hours ago. So this may differ sometimes from CoinGecko, but you know that CoinGecko is cached while this is directly from, uh, from the blockchain. So listen, this is how it is. Uh, go and uh, check it out. Go and try it right now. Because listen, if you are a Web3 developer, this is the least you can do. <laughs> this is the least you can do. If you cannot show the price, you cannot show 24 hour change, you have no DAP. You, you have nothing to do in Web3 development. So I'm telling you, go and try right now. <clears throat> Use it. Use it as soon as possible. You can do it on all kinds of different chains. You can supply the chain right here. I will support many, many chains, uh, as you can see. Uh, and uh, get going. Get going, guys, as soon as possible. Uh, let us know in the comment section how you find this API, whether you like it, whether you don't like it. And also, you can send in a list. Like, here is uh, another endpoint we have. <clears throat> if you click... Um, if you click here, you can send in a list of uh, of addresses also. Uh, this is useful in case you are building an app and you have a list view of many tokens. You can just send them all at once and get the prices and 24 hour change uh, all at once as well. So you can do it as a, as a token array as well. Uh, it's it's up to you. You can, you can do whatever fits you. We're here to help you. On that note, smash up the like. See you in the next video. Thanks a lot, guys. And bye-bye. Have a good day.